12th edition. It's a purse of $100,000, and it is a half-mile oval. The stretch is short, only 440 feet. Gary, your thoughts right now? Well, I think uh, Toontown has a real good shot from post five, and of course, uh, High Ho Silver Heels, the one to beat. Don't discount Misfit from the seven hole who won the Pacing Classic last week. Let's go up to Greg Young for the call from Northfield Park. Ready, aim, fire, and there goes Bahama Bunny right out for the lead. They're out for what is it, that clubhouse turn. Barreling right up along the rail goes Metropolis. Around the turn they go. And Metropolis along the inside, Bahama Bunny outside. They match up early along the outside. Jack Sue Brooks is racing third down along the rail. Village Connection fourth. Ohio Silver Hills away fifth. Margaret reports sixth. Then comes Toontown, the early trailer is misfit. They're at the quarter, they're out three wide. Here, 26 and three, out of the fire turn the first time. Metropolis with the lead, a length and a half. Bahama Bunny second, a length and a half. Racing along third is Jack Sue Brooks. Village Connection is there fourth. Hi Ho Silver Heels racing, Fifth Burger reports six, followed by Toontown. Trailing the field as they start to the halfway point of the race. And they pass the stands and on top. It's Metropolis by a neck, right up along the outside, challenging now at the half. Is Jack Sue Brooks in along the rail. Bahama Bunny third outside, Village Connection fourth outside. Hi Ho Silver Heels on the move, fifth. They hit the half in 55 and two. Around the turn they go in her payoff half mile. And as they swing for the backside, on top of the field, It'll be Metropolis by three quarters of a length, racing in between horses. Jack Sue Brooks now three wide. There goes Village Connection also moving out. It's going to be High Ho Silver Hills on the way. Then it's Toontown along the outside. They go to the three quarter mile back of the race. Village Connection takes them over there a length and a half in 125. On the turn, they're coming home in the Battle of Lake Erie. High Ho Silver Hills second by a length. In on the rail, Jack Sue Brooks outside. Toontown now trying to make it up. Web Market Report, around they come. They're at the top of Heartbreak Lane, a drive for the wire. And heading them down the lane, out there by a length and a half. It's Village Connection, trying to overhaul him. Here comes Idaho Silver Hills. Village Connection will hold on to win the battle in one fifty-three and three. So it's Village Connection, driven by Luke Wallet, trained by the Bill of Lake Wellworth. Erie. Idaho Silver Hills gets beat. The winner is Village Connection, the millionaire owned by the Wellwood Stables from Cambridge, Ontario. So a big night for Canada, trained by Bill Wellwood, driven to victory by Fresh Luke Wallet. So the son of Camp Bella, a five-year-old victorious tonight. Remember, Bill Wellwood also trained Village Jiffy. Here's a look at the returning prices, $14, $24, and $360. Hi-Ho Silver Heels second, $240 and $220. Toontown was third, $3.